David Wood didn't like the idea of living in Colorado's nuclear shadow. So before he built a home near Rocky Flats, he launched his own study to make sure it was safe. Investigator Rick Salinger tells us about the retired physics professor and why the man did his own inspection with a Geiger counter. Rocky Flats makes nuclear weapon components. From I was very aware of what was there. A longtime Coloradan, David Wood remembers Rocky Flats, the nuclear weapons facility, and the huge environmental cleanup that would follow. It gave me great pause. But Rocky Flats history would not deter Wood's dream of building a home nearby. He read all he could. Government websites said the area was safe, but he found an equal number of detractors raising health concerns. To my horror, no clear message emerged. So the retired physics professor launched his own study. He bought a Geiger counter and took his own radiation readings near Rocky Flats and in other sites around the state. The rates that I measured were entirely consistent with background radiation all over Colorado. He also took soil samples from his backyard and had them analyzed by the state health department. It came back consistent with there being no plutonium at all. Through his research, Wood was convinced building a home near Rocky Flats was safe. Namely, the cleanup had been successful. There were no hazards that I could detect. Now he's concerned about people raising fear about the safety of his new community. The public forums completely disrupted by people who have no quantitative point to make. They just fling their arms around in anxiety and say, this could happen, that could happen. We know pretty well already. This is not rocket science.